Hello once again audience, it is I, Dan here, aka for sky and welcome to my first, well, technically second video on a 4 sky Dort. Um, this is the first Pokemon video uh, that I'm doing Pokemon Sword gameplay uh, footage and pictures that I took. Uh, now I didn't get the full gameplay when I was going through because I'd have to keep pressing the record, record, record button or the screenshot, uh, hold hold it to, so it records every 30 seconds. Uh, and that would be absolutely annoying uh, through playing the game and would ruin the, the uh, whole, would ruin the fun I would have playing it. So yes, in the first video that I made for this channel, I said I could get three videos, two or three. I'm gonna get about four. This is a trial I'm running through. It's gonna be a sh the shortest one of the four. Um, I, when I was looking through all the footage I had and the pictures and all that, I was like, oh, it's going to get about four minutes or four uh, videos, probably six plus, six to ten minutes a piece. Let's jump into it. When, when I started playing the game, I did not record until I got to a certain point. I believe it was when I was running through the grass, I had already caught um, a couple Pokemon, and I wanted to make a... Uh, bug, um, a team of bug Pokemon for the first time that I've ever made that type of team in the Pokemon game, because so I liked a bunch of the new Pokemon, or the new bugs that I was looking at for this game, and I was like, alright, you know what, I'm going to keep the starter, and then I'm going to have five bug Pokemon. As I play, progress through, the team's going to change up a little bit. But anyway, okay, so here we go. So the first one that evolved was uh, my Blip Bug. It evolved into the Dottler, and I was just like, yeah, that's awesome. Um, I was so excited for that. Uh, then I had my Caterpie already evolved into a Metapod at this point. Um, and then after the Dottler, or the Blip Bug evolved into Dottler, I, th I think I'm pronouncing it right, I don't know. And I had. Uh, Butterfree, and uh, but I was like, oh yeah, you know, I'm gonna. They don't have Beedrill, but they have Butterfree. I like Beedrill over Butterfree, but Psychic Bug could come in handy. Within probably another half hour playing, my Grookey evolved into Thwacky, and I was like, oh, he's like, he's the coolest looking. The Grookey, his evolutions, the coolest looking out of all three for the starters. I, after playing, I, I really don't remember how long I was playing before. I spent a lot of time messing around, training and all that. So I like to be way ahead when I play. I recorded this footage here uh, where Hop and uh, the main character who I named Dante um, are getting ready to leave their town that they've spent I don't know how old they are, but their lifetime in up to this point. Now they're going to head out on their Pokemon journey. They get on the train, and I made sure to record that portion of it. So yeah, they're heading to Moto Stoke, uh, but first the wild area they're going to. Um, and the, oh, the wild area, I spent so many hours. Like, half of my time I've spent playing, actually more than half, like three quarters of the time i spent playing was in the wild area, because I, it was just so awesome. It's like the scenery, the music. Alright, so they arrive to the place, and now they're outside, she's talking to Sonia, who is, um, she is the assistant to the professor in this region. She explains a small amount about the wild area. And just look at that. Like, you could explore every inch of that, pretty much. And, uh... <clears throat> so... Yeah, and then after I mess around for... I had to have spent five hours training and just catching whatever I could catch. Then I ended up 
coming across Team Yell as I'm about to get ready to start my adventure with the whole uh, challenging the league uh, with all the different gym battles. I have some pictures there where my first uh, appearance there. Uh, and then the first battle against Hop. And I always, I feel so bad. There's, I have a couple pictures from that. I felt so bad, like, beating him, because he just kept so positive the whole time, and he's just like, beat him down, beat him down, and he kept going. Um, even though he seemed, like, super sad every time he lost. And then I ended up, uh, I didn't quite keep with the bug uh, team in the beginning. Um, I did get a Togepi, uh, which it evolved into a Togetic, of course. And then shortly after that, several hours, the Grookey evolved into a Rillaboom! I think I said that right. <laughs> uh, so, not only do you have Hop as a rival, you have two other rivals. Um, Bead and... I don't remember her name, I gotta look her up. There we go. And Marnie. I had to look on my phone. Uh, but Bead, when you come across him, I'm like, this dude is such a jerk. Like, he is such an asshole <laughs> of a rival. Yeah. Anyway, that's all I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, this is, yeah, the first part one of part four, possibly part five. Um, I really don't know. Once I start putting everything together, I'll figure out how many I have. But I hope you enjoyed. Uh, have a nice day, morning, evening, night, afternoon. And I'll see you in the next um, A4Sky Dork video.